Hi guys, welcome to Twitter's Funny Channel. Today I'm going to teach point of sale system step by step part 36 tutorial. Here I'm going to explain the update part of the uh, category part. So double click on this update button here. What I'm going to do is here go back to my uh, category part main item sorry item uh, form and here double click on here save button this will be the save button you click on this one sorry you copy on this coding and back come back to my item changing form after that double click on this one here here how to paste okay try and catch okay you have to copy from try to catch okay uh, form uh, item form and here i wrote their insert coding here i am going to write the update coding only update coding you don't need this two stuff okay other things as as the same here what i am going to do is here you have to write in the coding update after that what is the table name category is the table name set set name this name equal to what are the changes you made on the changes text box so this text box name okay this text box name what is the name of this text box txt name okay back to my txt name so how to write this one Sin single quotation double quotation double quotation single quotation within the double quotation we have to uh, put two add signs and here you have to type the text box name which is the text name set into here this will be our current record tv this will be the, our current record here updation will be when you are change anything else when, when the record is display you click on the data row the same record coming here in this put into this text boxes if you change something else this text box Change, uh, change something else here and click updated the record will be updated so I wrote here the name the column name I equal into this column name I equal into this text box the same thing I am going to do another thing description you just click on the if you have any problem with this one description you just write this is the same thing you have tried this description the selling will be the spelling will be must comma description equal single quotation double quotation double quotation single quotation within the quotations two plus sign here you have to write the text box name which is a description text box that is the stuff you have to do after that that is the thing you have to write okay it's successfully after that what i am going to do is where id equal into where id equal into here what i am going to do is here i have to equal into this id into one text boxes which is a text box so i back to my design view here i'm going to put one labor control here and drag point text box this one i drag here here let me change the name as id this one will be txt id sorry txt id okay. 
so this one you cannot you only uh, read you can't write on this text box here select this here and enable false otherwise you can write read only false okay so read only true read only true me you can't read only okay you can't write here so i put like this now what i'm going to do is here go to the for each loop i'm going to copy this one above i'm going to write here txt id equaling to this row which is i so let me execute the program and see if you click this one the id will be coming you can't change here you can only see you can't change here so let me move into our coding part here i am going to where id single quotation double quotation double quotation single quotation within the quotation i put two plus plus mark and i have to write the txt id text box okay because the id will be unique key so that i am taking the id and update the records so that i put put here txt id okay when you are execute this program when you are going to change anything else it's it this uh, two records has been changed according uh, getting this id what is the id here the record will be changed if you if it is a uh, id 2 the id 2 record will be display here the record will be changed okay first is check whether which, which id is coming from the data will be display the id is taken and and change change the records okay the text box but whatever enter in the text uh, txt name it is uh, change the record and updated to name whatever write in the description it's updated and uh, pass it to the dis, uh, dis, uh, description uh, uh, column okay this is the stuff it's happening i execute the program and show you that's very easy tough to understand here if you click this one whatever enter in this row in, in here in this field tv only and description only now it's a current data will be this one tv only tv only uh, now one if you enter tv new here tv new if you enter like this and click updated here you notice that this will be our current current data this will be our uh, current data this will be the current data now you update you click updated this will be your text box name txt name will be this one Tx, txd txds will be this one so what you wrote here this one will be passing to this variable name this one will be passing to this variable description set into this uh, variable and getting this id this id okay so connection open cmd execute query mean that the new record will be updated successfully okay now we check here so we check here what happen is person here tv new tv tv new only okay 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 let's check another record what happen let's close the program click to here ac new is new only click updated here you can notice that 
here go back to your database you can refresh it you can see AC new AC new only okay this is how you can update the records okay getting the ID okay what is the ID and update the record okay because why you are taking the ID and uh, update the record because this is will be the unique key okay here not record added updated record updated like this okay open the connection here close when you cmd dot execute when you call this method the entire uh, query will be updated okay if we, if, if, the, if the any error it passing to catch part this already these things i explained in my uh, previous tutorials i just uh, i just uh, change this part only okay i hope you understand uh, this uh, this coding so far so let me again execute this one sorry again what i am going to do is after updated what i am going to do is here i have to click the, this load button i am i am going to pass here also load data also i am going to pass here the same thing i am going to pass once the record has been updated connection will be closed and low data will be passed here so here let's take, execute the query and check it here if you select this one this entire row will be selected if there is anything wrong again you can load the data and select uh, another record ok if it is any, anything wrong you can select another record like this once uh, once you select the record like this if you, if you, if you change anything else and click update stuff updated here the data will be updated like this all all data you can see like this okay i hope you you, uh, you have all understand so far if you have any doubts you can ask me any times uh, if you like my channel please subscribe me thank you for watching